It all began in 1990 when the United Methodist Church decided to start a new congregation in the southern part of Kansas City. After a thorough search, Adam found a lovely but unusual place to worship, the McGilly Chapel Funeral Home. The Church of the Resurrection seemed like a good name. Ninety people came that very first day. McGilly Chapel soon began to feel very crowded, so our bold little congregation moved to Leewood Elementary School. It took a lot of work to make the school gym seem like a church every week, but we had more room for classes, nurseries, and fellowship. On Thanksgiving Day in 1993, we stomped through the muddy field to break ground and raise the cross in the place where the Leewood Campus East Building now stands. Our first new home of our own was finished just before Christmas a year later. We held our first service here on Christmas Eve 1994. Excitement was everywhere because that first building made so many things possible and new ministries quickly developed. But by the end of 1997, our congregation faced a familiar challenge. We were once again running out of room. People wanted to be here and they wanted to bring their families and friends. So we built a new larger sanctuary with classrooms and offices below. Again, we celebrated our first service there on Christmas Eve in 1998. It's a lot easier to describe in a short time, the buildings going up, the new locations added. It's harder to describe the really important changes that have happened all along the way. The changes in people's lives, the way whole families begin to live differently. The new understanding that reshaped people's hearts. That was true on Palm Sunday in 2004, when we moved into what's now known as the Leewood Campus West Building and our current sanctuary. This was a big move, and one that literally opened a vast array of new possibilities for our community. Around the same time, people who live far outside of Kansas City began choosing to worship at Resurrection, regardless of the distance from home. In fact, there was such a clear need for a Resurrection-type community in Western Johnson County that church leaders took another huge step, launching Resurrection West in Olathe in 2008. This church, which started in a junior high school, is now one of the largest congregations in the area. Resurrection Downtown launched in November of 2009 and is growing fast. This new congregation is dynamic and determined to be the very real presence of Christ in the midst of our booming urban center. And in August of 2010, we opened the doors to another campus, Resurrection Blue Springs. The church is in a great location, sitting just north of Interstate 70 in Missouri, and enables us to reach non-religious and nominally religious people in the eastern region of the Kansas City area. That brings us to today. A lot has happened in the last 20 years. It's sort of overwhelming when you think about it, but it's overwhelming in a good way, because we know that God has been at work here through so many different people in so many amazing ways. I don't think we'd feel the same if the history of our church was simply, we built a nice church for ourselves, we liked it the way it was, and we kept it that way. I'm glad we're the kind of church where extraordinary things have always happened, and where, I believe, they always will.